Good morning. Welcome to the Joyful Mysteries Rosary Prayer. In the name, oh, excuse me. The Blessed Virgin Mary promised to St. Dominic and to all who follow that whatever you ask in the rosary will be granted. She left for all Christians 15 promises to those who recite the Holy Rosary, imparted to St. Dominic and Blessed Alan de la Roche. Whoever shall faithfully serve me by the recitation of the rosary shall receive signal graces. I promise my special protection and the greatest graces to all those who shall recite the rosary. The rosary shall be a powerful armor against hell. It will destroy vice, decrease sin, and defeat heresies. Rosary will cause virtue and good works to flourish. It will obtain for souls the abundant mercy of God. It will withdraw the hearts of men from the love of the world and its vanities and will lift them to the desire for eternal things. Oh, that souls would sanctify themselves by this means. The soul which recommends itself to me by the recitation of the rosary shall not perish. Whoever shall recite the rosary devoutly, applying himself to the consideration of its sacred mystery, shall never be conquered by misfortune. God will not chastise him in justice. He shall not perish by an unprovided death. If he be just, he shall remain in the grace of God and become worthy of eternal life. Whoever shall have a true devotion for the rosary shall not die without the sacraments of the church. Those who are faithful to recite the rosary shall have during their life and at their death the light of God and the plenitude of his graces. At the moment of death, <clears throat> they shall participate in the merits of the saints in paradise. I shall deliver from purgatory those who have been devoted to the rosary. The faithful children of the rosary shall merit a high degree of glory in heaven. You shall obtain all you ask of me by the recitation of the rosary. All those who propagate the Holy Rosary shall be aided by me in their necessities. I have obtained from my divine Son that all the advocates of the Rosary shall have for intercessors the entire celestial court during their life and at the hour of death. All who recite the Rosary are my sons and daughters and brothers and sisters of my only Son, Jesus Christ. Devotion of my Rosary is a great sign of predestination. O oh, Immaculata, I renew my consecration to you. May all that I am and have belong entirely to you. This morning we will be praying through the Joyful Mysteries, beginning with the Apostles' Creed, followed by our intentions. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, I Amen. believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day, he rose again from the dead. He ascended to heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From there, he will come again to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Amen. On this day, the Eternal Father sent his angel to bring Mary the good news of our salvation. Let us turn to God and pray with confidence. Lord, fill our hearts with your love. You chose the Virgin Mary as the mother of your son, have mercy on all who look for you for your gift of salvation. You sent Gabriel to give Mary your message of peace and joy. Give to the whole world the joy of salvation and your gift of true peace. Mary gave her consent. The Holy Spirit overshadowed her, and your word came to dwell among us. Touch our hearts that we may welcome Christ as Mary did. You look with love on the humble and fill the heart hungry with your gifts. Raise up the downcast, help all in need, comfort and strengthen the dying. Lord our God, you alone work wonders and with you all things are possible. Give us the fullness of salvation when you raise up the dead on the last day. God our Father, your word became flesh and was born of the Virgin Mary. May we become more like Jesus Christ, whom we acknowledge as our Redeemer, God and man, we ask this through Jesus Christ, our Lord, 
who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. May the Lord bless us, protect us from evil, and lead, bring us to everlasting life. Amen. We are praying today for an increase of faith, hope, and charity. We are praying that grace and peace would be ours in abundance through the knowledge of God and of Jesus Christ our Lord. And we are praying that the Holy Eucharist may nourish our souls and make us bearers of hope and instruments of mercy. We all, and we also uh, lift as uh, our intention for this rosary, the prayer of St. Paul from the book of Romans, chapter 15, verses 5 and 6. May the God of endurance and encouragement grant you to live in such harmony with one another in accord with Christ Jesus, that together you may with one voice glorify the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, we lift up the corporal and spiritual prosperity of our parishes and the diocese of Salt Lake City. We ask for wisdom for Bishop Solis to shepherd God's flock. Ah, Bishop Solis and Bishop Peters? Yes. Or is it Bishop Peter? Uh, I think it's Peter. Peter. And Bishop Peter. We lift up the intentions of Fathers Vidal, both Fathers Josephs, Father Wheaton, Father Martin, Father Sternhagen, Cummins, Silva, Piers and Sandoval, and for the repose of the soul of Father Renee. Yeah, it's, that's his first name, uh, and I heard Father Joseph call it uh, Bishop Peter. Mm -hmm. So maybe I don't I don't know his last name. I'll look it up and see. We are praying for a hundred year vision for flame keepers that we might spread the fire of God's love throughout Utah and Idaho. We lift up our daily zoom rosaries and they're asking for an increase inwardly and fruitfulness outwardly and we lift up our weekly priestly discipleship on zoom coming up this friday morning at 5 30 a.m chapter six of spiritual direction oh uh, we lift up our bi weekly power pods and are asking for continued spiritual growth and an increase of pause among all of the Flamekeeper locations. We lift up our monthly friendship breakfast. Next one is uh, September 11th. Is that accurate, Jeff? September 11th. Is, did we ever decide on that? <laughs> we never decided on a date. So, uh, okay. I mean, we can. We can make that happen, I'm sure. Okay, we'll figure it out. I wasn't sure. <laughs> the old date. Okay. We'll figure it out. Yeah, just let me know and I can... Uh, Right. Can, uh, get with Mary. It would be nice to have it so when we're at the retreat and do these, we'll have a, a d actual date to yeah. plant people's minds. I think it's September, just a of September. It. September 11th seems a little too far. It seems like we need to have because like the breakfast is going to be a big follow up breakfast for the retreat, you know. So it seems like we maybe plus should it's do 9 it. 11, which I don't yeah, know if that matters. It. Yeah. So I'm wondering, but anyways, we'll take a look at dates and decide, huh? Because that, that's going to be, we're going to use that, that friendship breakfast as a, uh, a follow-up and the way we used to do a barbecue, but the barbecue is never very successful when we tried to do it at St. Mary's inside the cafeteria. Mm -hmm. And it's like, no one would show up, but I think that this breakfast is going to be awesome. And I want to push it at the retreat just because it'll introduce them, not just to the follow-up breakfast, but to the monthly breakfast. I don't know. It'll be just good. You know, I love that American yeah. Legion breakfast. It's awesome. FYI, it's Bishop Peter Christensen. All right. Cool. All right. We're on the uh, monthly fire pit fellowships. The dates are all messed we up. We lift up our monthly fire pit fellowships. Appreciate the beautiful one that we had yesterday, dear Lord, in the lab. Um, and um, praying for a future one in Orem. Uh, and all of these, we pray for our relationships to deepen and love to increase. Hey, man, we lift up uh, the monthly Misery Cordia outreach and circles program. Date to be determined. We lift up our the annual men's and women's retreat, and especially the 100-year fire 11th annual men's retreat on August 13th to the 15th annual a women's retreat date and time to be uh, location to be determined the building of the bathrooms and showers the completion of them at the idaho retreat site that grace will be poured out upon chris and art and entire 
team of builders and that the supernatural productivity of the divine provision of materials would Amen. be had. Amen. Registrations seem to be trickling in now. The, 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 the dam should break any moment. Feels like every time I open up my email, there's something new. Today, some stranger named Larry Parks registered. So <laughs> we, uh, we lift up all developing FK Ministries, Anabalas Angels, laborers for 24-7 prayer and worship, burning ones, young adult internship, final quest book reading tool for discipleship coming this Friday, this Friday. Uh, almost saved evangelism coming soon. I power Christian fellowship coming soon. Joseph company praying for local businesses and workers bi-weekly family fast prayer for parent child relationships. Uh, where am I at loss? Oh, we ask for authority over the fear of death, authority over the spirit of the fear of death and authority over death itself to manifest through our lives. We ask for authority over every demon from hell, the same way Enoch had overcome every wicked spirit and had authority in the earth. And we pray that the fruit of your sufferings, Jesus, may be renewed in our souls by the faithful remembrance of your passion. And may your love increase in our hearts each day until we see you in eternity. You who are the treasury of every real good and every joy, which we beg thee to grant us, so sweet as Jesus in heaven. Amen. Amen. We also want to continue to lift up the needs of our nation, especially the needs of those suffering from the current COVID-19 situation. Please protect America and make her a burning and shining lamp for the Lord. And now let us unify our minds and spirits in a prayer for the United States of America, composed by His Excellency Archbishop Carlo Maria Vigano. Almighty, eternal God, King of kings and Lord of lords, graciously turn your gaze to us who invoke you with confidence. Bless us, citizens of the United States of America. Grant peace and prosperity to our nation. Eliminate those who govern us so that they may commit themselves to the common good in respect for your holy law. Protect those who defending the inviolable principles of the natural law and your commandments must face the repeated assaults of the enemy of the human race. Keep in the hearts of your children courage for the truth, love for virtue, and perseverance in the midst of trials. Make our families grow in the example that our Lord has given us together with his most holy mother and St. Joseph in the home of Nazareth. Give to our fathers and mothers a gift of strength to educate wisely the children with which you have blessed them. Give courage to those who in spiritual, bat spiritual combat fight the good fight as soldiers of Christ against the furious forces of the children of darkness. Keep each one of us, O Lord, in your most sacred heart, and above all, he whom your providence has placed at the head of our nation. Bless the President of the United States of America so that aware of his responsibility and his duties, he may be a knight of justice, a defender of the oppressed, a firm bulwark against the, your enemies, and a proud supporter of the children of light. Place the United States of America and the whole world under the mantle of the Queen of Victories, our unconquered leader in battle, the Immaculate Conception. It is thanks to her and through your mercy that the hymn of praise rises to you, O Lord, from the children whom you have redeemed in the most precious blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Now, if anyone has an intention they'd like to lift up, please feel free to unmute your microphone and do so. Hmm. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. <clears throat> Want to lift up um, Betty Counts uh, that they should be found. She's an elderly lady that's uh, missing in Oregon. Went off, I guess, hiking, and they're still looking for her. Uh, she has dementia, like they said, and uh, just probably wandering around somewhere. Maybe, dear God, please uh, have somebody spot her or somebody lead her to home. She has many people worried about her, dear God. Please protect her. Amen. Please protect her, dear God. I'd like to offer up my daughter uh, finding a place to live, looking for a new house in this economy. It's uh, very difficult to find a place, dear God. So I ask for you to intervene to help her find her new place and uh, to help her and all, all that takes all that's involved with that, dear God. Amen. 
Amen. Amen. Just want to continue to lift up um, our baby in the womb and just Mackenzie's pregnancy or just good health for her. Um, just, yeah, just grace for the pregnancy, grace for the child. That this would be a child that would know you, Lord, that would know you. Amen. Amen. Praying for all um, outpouring of men that you have chosen, Lord, to be at this retreat. We ask, Lord, that they be moved and get registered. We can keep track of the necessary logistic support for this, Lord God, and uh, be put in binds at the last minute. Um, we just ask that your graces would flow upon um, everyone coming and that uh, your presence would be well known from amen and lord i just lift up oh i'm sorry bob i thought you were done go ahead no, you're fine. i was gonna say i just i kind of lift up the retreat itself and uh lord i know i know that all the things that are planned the rosaries the adoration the masses the the procession that those are all going to touch people um i just ask that on top of all the different activities of spiritual activities that there would just be amazing moments of, of relationship. God, that there would be joy and laughter. God, that there would be uh, just, just awesome, tender moments, Lord, that men would, uh, <clears throat> would connect with each other and with you, Lord. Like that there would just be a deep, 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 connection that your presence more than anything lord we just want a manifestation of your presence at this retreat that it would just be that gooey honey just presence of the lord and and the blessed mother that nurturing mercy that tenderness lord that it would be a family affair that, that the presence of saints and angels and you, Lord Jesus, and the Virgin Mary, God, that there would just be a supernatural presence of love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, Lord, that there would just be a tangible Holy Spirit, that the Trinity would be glorified, that the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit would be glorified, that the, that the saints and angels, the, their presence would be known, God, that men would have supernatural encounter with heavenly realms Amen. at this retreat, God, with heavenly realms and together that men would have supernatural encounters that all of us, God, would have supernatural with heavenly realms, that we would have a breakthrough into a new realm, a new reality of the kingdom of God that we could then carry back to our homes, back to jobs, back to this city, back to our cities, our families, supernatural breakthrough God into realms that men would encounter angels, saints, you God, that there would be just a supernatural encounter with heavenly realms in Jesus name, Lord, that you would far outdo anything we've experienced in the past in terms of signs, wonders, miracles. God, we ask for some signs, wonders, and miracles, Lord. Yes, and you would Lord. do a great work in those who are there, Father. A great work. And I do ask that this would, would bust open the door for the future for prayer, word, and relationship to spread its way through Idaho, God. That, that there would be some other uh, torch carriers who would take their experience and begin carrying a torch deeper into Idaho, Lord. Um, God, I pray for our preparation as we move forward toward the retreat, that we get all of our protocols in order for how we do things online, I, 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 that you would uh, shape us up, sharpen us up, make us ready um, to, to be able to connect with any, any torch carriers <clears throat> that are going to arise from this retreat who want to really spread um, what we're doing through Idaho as well, Lord. Hmm. Amen. Yeah, let this retreat, God, thank you that we're almost here, God, that we've survived this year of the year of COVID and then the year of, of going out outside of a parish. Um, 
I thank you for the words uh, from Father Joseph yesterday, who said, yeah, the, the farther away you stay from the flagpole, the better. And uh, I thank you, Lord, that you have sustained us uh, as we've just tried to steward whatever you're asking us to do with resume rosaries and friendship breakfasts and building bathrooms and annual retreats and power pods. And, oh, Lord, we, we've just we've just been trying to obey and steward and, and you have sustained us and we're about to pull off this annual retreats. We thank you and we ask for supernatural encounter and for it to bust open doors for the spreading of the gospel. That's what we're saying. Amen. Spreading of the gospel throughout Idaho, uh, a raising of the bar that, that folks will be set on fire uh, here in Utah and in Idaho, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Mm. Well, oh, yes. Uh, Lord, that, that, that even uh, just lift up that I know that there are, there's, if there, there's more Catholics in Idaho uh, that there would just be a, an open door for young adults in Idaho, God, that, that this door of Idaho would open up doors for, for the Devons to get to, to flap their wings and, and go on little missions trips out to other places um, for purposes of evangelism and for just cross-pollinating with other believers. Mm. Amen. Anyone else praying for the will of the Blessed Mother in the service of, to the Blessed Mother for the glory of the King, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, we love you. Save the souls of the unborn children, all souls in purgatory, all priests and religious, and all marriages and families. Queen of the Most Holy Rosary. Pray for us. Hey, I'm sorry, I gotta grab my, my power cord. It's usually in the right spot, but I gotta go grab it. First joyful mystery is the Annunciation. Before we pray the Our Father, followed by the decade of Hail Mary, join with us for meditative purposes in the recitation of O Mary of all women. O Mary of all women, you are the chosen one who ancient prophets promised would bear God's only son. All Hebrew generations prepared the way to thee that in your womb, the God-man might come to set us free. O Mary, you embody all God taught to our race. For you are first and foremost in fullness of grace. We praise this wondrous honor that you gave birth to him who from you took humanity and saved us from our sin. Then the first joyful ministry, the Annunciation, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, we love you. Save the souls of the unborn children, all souls in purgatory, all priests and religious, and all marriages and families. Queen of the Most Holy Rosary. Pray for us. The second joyful mystery is the visitation of the Blessed Virgin to Elizabeth. And before we pray, the Our Father, followed by the decade of Hail Mary, join with us for meditative purposes in the recitation of the Magnificat. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God, my Savior, for he has looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day, all generations will be called, call, will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him in every generation. He has shown the strength of his arm. He has scattered the proud in their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things, and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel, for he has remembered this, his promise of mercy, the promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham and his children forever. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. Amen. The visitation of the Blessed Virgin to Elizabeth. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, we love you. Save the souls of the unborn children, all souls in purgatory, all priests and religious, and all marriages and families. Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, pray for us. The third joyful mystery is the nativity of our Lord. And before we pray there, our Father, followed by the decade of Hail Mary, join with us for meditative purposes in the recitation of what child is this? What child is this who laid to rest on Mary's lap is sleeping, whom angels greet with anthems sweet while shepherds watch our keeping? This, this is Christ the King, whom shepherds guard and angels sing. Haste, haste to bring him laud, the babe, the son of Mary. Why lies he in such mean a state where ox and ass are feeding? Good Christians fear for sinners here, the silent word is pleading. Nails, spear shall pierce him through, the cross be born for him, for me, for you. Hail, hail the word made flesh, the babe, the son of Mary. So bring him incense, gold and myrrh, come peasant king to own him. The king of kings salvation brings, let loving hearts enthrone him. Raise, raise a song on high, the virgin sings her lullaby. Joy, joy, for Christ is born, the babe, the son of Mary. The nativity of our Lord Jesus, our Father, oh, that's you, sorry. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, a world without end. Amen. Amen, O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, we love you. Save the souls of the unborn children, all souls in purgatory, all priests and religious, and all marriages and families. Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, pray for us. The fourth joyful mystery is the presentation of Jesus in the temple. And before we pray the Our Father, followed by the decade of Hail Mary, join with us for meditative purposes in a reading of the presentation of Jesus in the temple. Mary and Joseph take the baby Jesus to Jerusalem to present him to the Lord. The presentation of Jesus in the temple is in fulfillment with Jewish law. Every firstborn male child must be taken to the temple and an animal must be offered as a sacrifice. That is why Joseph is usually artistically depicted in this scene holding a cage with two doves in it. The prophet Simeon and the prophetess Anna meet the Holy Family while at the temple in Jerusalem. Simeon was told by God that he would see the Savior before he died. Simeon, when Simeon sees baby Jesus, he takes him from Mary and holds him in his arms and praises God, proclaiming, Now thou dost dismiss thy servant, O Lord, according to thy word in peace, because my eyes have seen thy salvation. Simeon then blesses Mary and Joseph and prophesies to Mary. Behold, this child is set for the fall and for the resurrection of many in Israel, and for a sign that shall be contradicted. In thy own soul a sword shall pierce, so that the thoughts of many hearts may be revealed. Even though this is a joyful occasion, you can see in the words of Simeon a foreshadow of the sorrows that will be shared between Jesus and his mother Mary. Mary suffered with Jesus from the beginning to the end. Anna also proclaims that this child, the baby Jesus, is the long-awaited Messiah. After all this, the Holy Family leaves Jerusalem and returns to Nazareth. There they live in peace and joy for many years before Jesus begins his public life. For the Bible says the child grew and waxed strong, full of wisdom, and the praise of God was with him. The presentation of Jesus in the temple. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace. The Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, we love you. Save the souls of the unborn children, all souls in purgatory, all priests and religious, and all marriages and families. Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, pray for us. The fifth joyful mystery is the finding of Jesus in the temple. And before we pray the Our Father, followed by the decade of hell, Mary join with us for meditative purposes in the recitation of chapter 2, verses 41 through 52 from the Gospel according to St. Luke. Each year his parents went to Jerusalem for the feast of the Passover. And when he was taken and when he was 12 years old, they went up according to festival custom. After they had completed its days, as they were returning, the boy Jesus remained behind in Jerusalem, but his parents did not know it. Thinking that he was in the caravan, they journeyed for a day and looked for him among their relatives and acquaintances. But not finding him, they returned to Jerusalem to look for him. After three days, they found him in the temple, sitting in the midst of the teachers, listening to them and asking them questions. And all who heard him were astounded at his understanding and his answers. When his parents saw him, they were astonished. And his mother said to him, son, why have you done this to us? Your father and I have been looking for you with great anxiety. And he said to them, why were you looking for me? Did you not know that I must be in my father's house? But they did not understand what he said to them. So he went down with them and came to Nazareth and was obedient to them. And his mother kept all these things in her heart. And Jesus advanced in wisdom and age and favor before God and man. The fifth joyful mystery, the finding of Jesus in the temple. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit 
as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thy mercy. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, we love you. Save the souls of the unborn children, all souls in purgatory, all priests and religious, and all marriages and families. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph, we love you. Save the nope, oops, nope, queen. Nope. Sorry, Queen of the Most <laughs> Holy Rosary. <laughs> Pray for us. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor vanished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in the valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, thine eyes of mercy towards us, and after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus, O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant we beseech thee that by meditating upon these mysteries of the most holy rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Remember, O most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who fled to your protection and implored thy help or sought thy intercession was left unaided. Inspired by this confidence, I fly unto thee, O Virgin of virgins, my mother. To thee do I come, before thee I stand, sinful and sorrowful. O Mother of the Word incarnate, despise not my petitions, but in thy mercy hear and answer me. Amen. Amen. Praying for the intentions of the Pope. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.